the one to be happy that you have prosperity after that. I am the other day care of you all. I will chop you into pieces. Do whatever you go. At last, you have to come to me, my dear honey. Up, 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 up. I will turn you into sin and kill you into boy in my way. Hi guys, I'm Kavanaya and you're watching Kavita Vaivya. So in my previous week vlogs, we have covered the Flower Dome and Cloud Forest in Gardens by the Bay. So today is the last main attraction which is Floral Fantasy. Let's go and have fun there. Floral Fantasy is the indoor garden with hanging blossoms and poison dart flowers and waterfall. the hanging blossoms they're going up and down consecutively i did it wow Guys, this place is really awesome for a good photo shoot. Look at the horse and the unicorn standing right behind. I love the color of the flowers over there. I love lavender the most and the color is really vibrant and they have made a good setup to take a lot of good pictures over here. Not only this place, like there are a lot of places in this um, floral fantasy where you can get a lot of good pictures. So I'm going to have a great photo shoot over here. This entire place is decorated with dry and used plants from suspended bouquets. This garden is set up with more than 15,000s of dry and natural flowers. bird in real life also has the same color of feathers so look at the color it is so pretty and that's how the god has gifted the nature with lot of beautiful and colorfulness There is a very beautiful and small fountain going on and look at the colors and the lights. The highlights of the pearl fantasy is the colorful. This place is filled with lot of colors which I love the most. As I told you guys this entire place is made up of the used flowers. So this structure is made out of the preserved flowers which we also use for making the soap and other some other stuff.
Each flower here has a unique color and that's what admires me the most. The special thing I like about this place is when you go during night time, you can see like the colors are so vibrant than during the day time. You can see them like really bright during night time. So I was lucky to go during night and experience the feeling. This, this structure is really, really awesome. It's so giant and look at the flowers on the top. They look so pretty. A tree woman, I would say. But this one is a real latest one and So let me tell you guys a few things about floral fantasy So this place is basically the largest thematic and this is also a latest attraction which is found in gardens by the way And it has a lot of flowers in an art study and a very technological method It's filled with a lot of colors and I love that the most over here. There are a lot of hanging blossoms here. So each one has a different kind of flower and creeper. This waterfall is a very unique kind of waterfall. Look at the colors and the vibrant you get. It's really, really awesome. There are no words to describe the beauty of this waterfall. So this is the place where you can find the poison drag frogs. Look! It's actually a mini frog but it's, uh, it actually secretes the poison and it looks like a toy but it's a real frog. Color one is over there. That's so cute. So this frog is found in various colors. We only saw the green and the yellow one. These there are a lot of varieties here, but none of them is coming out. The most thing which I like here is those banyan creepers, which are just hanging down. This gives you like a dense jungle feel and I like the effect.
before visiting this place i thought that this would be something with decorations of the suspended bouquets and dry flowers and stuffs but i was totally wrong i didn't expect this place to have such beautiful sculptures all over and big fountains which are so colorful and the waterfall oh my god those poison dart frogs i didn't expect colorful frogs to exist on this earth and i was really astonished when i saw them this place gives you a very colorful and good vibe and there is like a mild music going on throughout the place and that's the main thing which i like the most about this place One thing which is surprising me more over here is each and every flower over here requires a different climate and environment to grow but everything is set up beautifully and it's growing in the same environment so obviously the people who created this would have worked really hard to make this place come out good got to know that this place over here the decorations are like it keeps on changing according to the themes and stuffs so i can't even imagine that happening because it's going to take them really a uh, hard work and a lot of time to change it but still they're doing it so it's a very appreciable thing so make sure when you come to singapore to visit this place to have a very colorful adventure This place was like a dream come true because of the colors and all the kind of unique flowers. This one is a very fantastical experience for all the visitors coming over here and you get like a really colorful and good vibe over here. Okay guys, now we come to the end of the vlog. I hope this floral fantasy gave you a colorful vibe. If you like this video, please do like, share, comment and subscribe and do tell your feedbacks in the comment box below. See you in my next video. Until then, bye-bye. Thank you.